Hello, welcome to JXJ Aviation. In this video, we will be looking at GNSS augmentation systems. First, let's look at what is GNSS. GNSS stands for Global Navigation Satellite System. This system consists of a constellation of satellites which broadcast signals that are picked up by receivers. These receivers can be installed on an aircraft and the signal information is used to compute the aircraft's position and time reference. What is GNSS augmentation? The GNSS signals may have some errors induced because of atmospheric interference, clock error, or signal delay. GNSS augmentation is used to solve these issues. GNSS augmentation refers to techniques that are used to enhance the accuracy and integrity of the GNSS signals. There are two primary types of GNSS augmentation. Satellite-based augmentation system, SBAS, and ground-based augmentation system, GBAS. Let's look at these augmentation systems. Satellite-based augmentation system, SBAS, has a network of high-accuracy ground reference stations. These stations monitor the GNSS signals and compute the errors induced in these signals and create rectification data. This data from the ground station is sent to a central processing facility. The facility verifies the correction data to further improve the accuracy and integrity of the signals. The correction data are sent to geostationary satellites, which transmit the corrected signals to the aircraft. The aircraft uses this corrected high accuracy signal information to compute its position. Ground based augmentation system. This system also has ground reference stations installed in a specific area, such as an airport. These stations monitor the GNSS signals and compute the error induced in these signals and calculate the correction data. The correction data also takes into account the local factors, such as atmospheric effects and satellite positioning. This data is sent to a ground processing facility, which verifies the data accuracy and sends it to the aircraft. The aircraft receiver uses this accurate information to calculate its position. Advantages of GNSS augmentation The signals from satellite-based and ground-based augmentation systems are used for high-accuracy position computation. Since the signal accuracy and integrity is verified on ground, the aircraft can directly process these signals without verification. SBAS can be used for localizer performance with vertical guidance, LPV approaches, which is similar to a precision approach. GBAS can be used for ground-based landing system, or GLS, which is considered a precision approach. SBAS can be used for regional or wide area signal corrections. This information can be used by an aircraft in the terminal area or the cruise phase. GBAS is more focused on localized signal corrections. These signals can be adjusted according to specific airfield requirements, such as terrain clearance, maximum runway utilization, reducing aircraft noise, That's all for my video on the GNSS augmentation systems. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please share and subscribe. And you can continue watching some of my other videos as well.